Lovelies, it's Addie here. Welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be talking about Antonio's watches. Is it a scam? Is it real? Is the product good? So that's something we're going to be talking about today. So if you guys want to know more about Antonio's watches, you want to know my experience of it, and if you want to know if it's a scam or not, just keep on watching. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, um, Antonio's Watches is a watch brand, I think from the US, and they had this recent promo. Basically, you get their watches for free, but you have to pay for shipping. If you check out their Facebook page and their website, so many people are really questioning if this is real, if this is a scam, what do they get out of it. So many people are not sure if this is a real thing, if this is a real promo, if this is a brand, if this is a scam, and all of that stuff. I one of those people so I decided to check it out for myself I ordered four watches and I paid a total of 2,500 pesos for shipping because apparently it ships from the US apparently I don't know but anyway you get you'll get what I mean later when we start checking out the packages I received three packages yes this is exactly how the packaging looks like so weird i don't know why it looks this bad i i don't i don't know why it looks this bad and there's only three i ordered four but i only got three so where's my other watch antonia's watches why do you only send me three also to top it all off i not only paid for shipping for these. I also had to pick it up from the post office and when you pick a package up from the post office, you have to pay extra money. I think I paid around 100 to 200 pesos per package. So basically, everything I ordered from Antonio's watches became like 3,000 pesos for three watches and it was supposed to be four watches so I'm super angry about that because the watch that didn't arrive is the one thing I really wanted and I'm super pissed about that but you know what I'm trying to be objective here so yeah let's start by opening the packages so it's uh, all right so at least they got my name correctly and my address but if you check this out it says it's from Xiaoman number 100 Renmin Road Kunyang Wenzhou Zhejiang China this is from China the brand is marketed as a brand from the US but it's shipped from China what what why just from here it, it it's kind of it kind of screams scam already but you know what let's let's just go with it let's check out what's inside the package okay I basically tore it there's a watch in here and there is okay there's a weird is this a bracelet? I don't know. And there's like a weird gong thing on it. And I'm assuming this is battery, right? This is the watch. Well, at least they made an effort to protect the watch. This is it. Like it doesn't come in a box or anything. It's just a plastic. It's like watches you buy from DV. And you know what? Probably if I go to DV, I'll find this exact watch. It's probably just 50 pesos. This is how the watch looks like right now. I actually picked this one out. This one is supposed to have, this is a marble faced watch. It's supposed to be black and white marble but for some reason this is like yellowish green and black. It's not what I ordered and if you look closely the quality looks pretty bad. If you look here it looks kind of okay. Maybe because my lights are good, I don't know. But if you look closely there's so many uneven paint. And if you check out the back, I can see the glue. Like right here, I can see the glue and all the, oh my god. Well, this is really China made, obviously. Wow. I totally got gypped. This next one is from, this one's from Singapore? What? I kid you not, it says here, P.O. Box 916 Singapore. That's so weird. So the first one came from China and this one's from Singapore? I don't know. Let's check it out. This is weird. All right, so there's a foam thingy. Again, no box, no case whatsoever, but it is in a plastic. Hmm. This is how it looks like. This isn't bad. Like it actually really looks like the picture. The face of the watch is black and it has rose gold accents to it so at least they didn't fail on that end but 
the quality is also really bad I don't know if if you check out the sides there's just some of it like chipping off oh my god it broke right here there's a there's a chip like it it broke oh and same thing I can see the glue that they used it's I don't know, I guess I thought since this one was from Singapore, it would have better quality, but I guess not. But this does look way better than this first watch, so. Last but not least, we have another one for, okay, this is also from Singapore. Let's open this up. Another spongy thingy. Well, not spongy, it's like a foam thing. Again, no case whatsoever. This is how it looks like. Actually, if you look closely, there's a brand on it. It says JIS. But I bought this from Antonio's watches. They didn't even bother to replace the brand name on it. Really? Really? <laughs> this one has the best quality. I don't know why. Except for the annoying brand thing. Yeah, this one looks pretty cool. It's a triangle with a clear thing. I don't know. I, I just thought it was a, such a cute style. The strap is actually better quality. And it has a label here that says genuine leather. I don't know. Is that accurate are you really genuine i don't know now i'm just talking to the watch this i think is the best watch <laughs> compared to the other two quality wise but design wise i like the design of this one more i'm just happy i can switch out the straps this strap for example i like but it's also a bit dirty here i don't i thought this was brand new why is it dirty here all right so that's it final thoughts i think hmm uh huh I don't think we can really call it a scam because they actually did send me stuff but the quality of it is not at all what was on their website it's cheaply made so I don't know like it's just I'm honestly so disappointed because the first time I saw the ad I actually felt amazed that there was actually a company out there who really believed in their product so much that they just wanted to put it out there for free and people just have to pay for shipping because it ships from the US and all that stuff and it's just so disappointing to me that the product itself is just it's terrible. It's bad quality. It's not even exactly what I ordered. It's so bad and it's obviously China made and I can't believe they are doing this to people. I find it so sad that there are people in this world who want to jip people in this way. I mean, yes, it's not a full on scam because they actually give you a product in exchange for your money, but it's for me, it's a scam in the sense that I expected a quality product. I expected to get all of the products I ordered actually. I only got three out of the four ordering it, getting into it. I already knew that there was a big chance it's gonna be a scam, but you know, I still went for it because I was so curious. You know, lesson learned. Never order from this stuff. And you know what? There are actually more watch brands that just surfaced after this Antonio Swatch was one and then they're doing the same promo, pay for shipping and all that stuff. I highly, highly suggest that you just not go for it. This is probably like a 50 peso watch from the Visoria. It's not worth the money. It's not at all worth the shipping from the US or anything even though my packages clearly say they're from China and Singapore. I don't know. I don't know why they do that. They could have at least had it shipped from the US or something. It's just it baffles me and it angers me and it saddens me that there are people who do these things. I tried it out for you guys. I want you guys to know that this is what you get if you try out the Antonio's watches thing. The products were free, just pay for shipping. You're not gonna get all the products you ordered. They're gonna be shipped to the, the post office and not directly to your house. So you have to pay additional taxes for it. And the quality's bad. It's not even gonna be exactly what you ordered. And it's just full on disappointing. If ever you were curious as to what happens if ever you did order, now you know and now I know and now I'm never gonna order from anything like this ever again. Final verdict, I think it's a scam. I think this whole Antonio's Watches promo that the product is completely free, you just pay for shipping, it's a scam because it's, it's crazy. And it didn't even come from the address I expected it to come from. You know, it didn't even say Antonio's Watches Company or anything like that. Like, you know how when you order from Zalora, it says from Zalora, Philippines. No, it came from a person, which is so weird. Not a company, just an individual person. That's it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so, so much for watching. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys on my next video. 
Bye guys. Mwah.